Huh? Yo, oh, we bro. do this every time. What's going on, guys? Bradley Martin. Today, I'm going to give you guys a upper body routine. This is basically chest and arms, clavicle and elbows. Um, obviously, for me, I always hit my triceps at like, I mean, to be truthful, I hit my triceps probably like four times a week. So, whether it be like a chest routine or an arm routine, like, it's always going to involve some sort of triceps. Even like back stuff, back routines all involve some sort of tricep work because my triceps are so trash, uh, which I am working on. Like, you guys know this. You guys make jokes in my Instagram videos like, I did the 170 overhead, and they're like, oh, triceps are trash, huh? When I say trash, I don't mean strength, because obviously I have a good amount of strength in my triceps, but what I'm talking about when I say trash is aesthetically for like the balance of my bicep versus my tricep versus my shoulder, like my, my shoulder and my bicep are much bigger than my tricep. So for me to bring those up so they can just be a little bit more dominant, that's my goal. So that's why I include triceps in a lot of my routine. So this routine started off uh, incline bench. And I want to start off by also saying that all of my chest exercises, probably for the last like six months, truthfully, almost to a year, everything has been like, I'm trying to focus on building my upper chest because naturally I always kind of had a good, I don't even call this a sweet, what would you call this? Sweet? Low, lower chest. Lower, I mean lower chest. Yeah. Yeah. Or something like lower chest. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Lower, lower, mid, upper. No, bro, don't work that way. Point, I'm just talking about like, okay, yeah, there's there's multiple muscles right in the chest, but they say lower, mid, but point is like this portion, I don't like it, fucking upper chest has always <laughs> been flat, right? It's always been kind of like, cause I'm wider, right? So it's always been like kind of kind of flat here and it's always bigger here. Now, so I've focused for like the last six months, everything on my upper chest trying to get like, trying to get this, can you see it? Can you see it bro? Yeah, trying to get like, I'm done. trying to get like that, this shit here. That's pretty good. So I've been working on it, working on it, working on it and it has made improvement because all my emphasis when I hit chest is, is been focusing on actually not just like doing movements that are upper chest, like, you know, incline presses and different things like that, but really focusing on using that portion of my chest. I know it sounds weird, cause like, when you bench, you use your chest, you just use your chest, right? But I'm actually like, in my mind, I don't know if it's just voodoo magic or like witchcraft or wizardry or something, but I'm like actually like pressing, I'm thinking about like trying to feel that, trying to like almost mentally like build that shit. Like, so I don't know how else to describe it, but that's what I've been doing and it has made, has helped me make big improvements in my chest. So anyways, the routine started off like this, incline bench press, Worked at 315, didn't go crazy heavy, wasn't feeling super strong because I haven't tested the, those waters uh, for the last like, fucking two months. I kind of just been bullshitting a little bit. Um, anyways, long story short, I did the four sets. I worked up, did drop set, came down, um, did another set with uh, 315 just to, just to burn it out, just to get blood because um, I felt good doing that. And then I took probably like two minute rest in between each of those sets, moved on to the next exercise, right to biceps, right? That's what we did with biceps was the next one. It was the, yeah, yeah. the, the variation of, um, I don't know if you guys have any type of machine curls, but I just did a variation on like the, the I don't know what kind of machine that is. It's got like a horizontal pad. And you can do this with one that's here. It's just the, uh, I'm trying to think, cause most people aren't gonna have the horizontal pad. No. They'll have one of those ones that are preacher. Yeah. And a pull, so what, what I'm doing is, the first portion of the set, and there's two, there's like two, it's like, I don't know, it's, it's not even a super set. Two sections, right, of the same uh, exercise. So it's not like one, one, or it's not like one, rest, one. It's one, one, then rest. So it's going like this. I did like a um, partial reps. So if you guys have the, the preacher curl like this, you're gonna grab it and you're gonna do partial reps, right? So you're not going all the way down, all the way up, right? You're, just, you're staying in this range of motion here. And then do as many as you can in this range of motion. And then sit all the way back down and then go all the way down, all the way up, all the way down, all the way up, as many as you can. And then rest. And then that's that's one. Okay, so boom, boom, one. Many rest, two minute rest, go again, boom, boom, two. Okay, and I did that four times. So it's like one, two, one, one, two, two, one, two, three, one, two, four. See what I'm saying? Um, after that, for me, just direct tricep work, focusing on two different angles when I'm doing like the overhead extension. One is I keep my elbows facing out and I'm just worried about pressing out. Uh, even though I have you, I have a barbell. You can pick a barbell, whatever feels comfortable for your wrist, really. So focus on pressing out and then the next one you can focus on keeping your elbows forward and pressing like out and towards like like the face, the direction you're facing. So you're pressing like your elbows are kind of forward and you're pressing away from you versus the first, the first one, I'm pressing up and out, okay? Same thing there, I'm kind of going like boom, boom, and then rest, boom, boom, and then rest. So those two, spice it up a little bit. And then next exercise, which one was it? Was the, the variation of the military press, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay, so 
the variation of the military press. This is something you guys, obviously you sit in these little military chairs and you normally people are doing this like overhead shoulder work. What I'm doing is um, obviously involving my shoulders, but I'm trying to really arch my back, arch my back really far so it almost becomes like an incline bench again. Um, and I'm letting my body, not my body, I'm letting my elbows kind of like rotate in at the bottom and then come out and squeeze. Like I'm trying to squeeze my my shit together up here and feel the contraction here. It's, it's so hard to explain this shit. Like a lot of stuff would be easier to explain to you guys in person, but obviously we're not here. I'm doing my best. So understand that. Um, and that also gives me another idea with something I've been thinking about for a long time was I'm going to start doing, uh, I wouldn't call them training seminars or meet and greets or something, but I'm going to do, start doing like a tour where I get a bunch of people to show up to like a gym and we just have a ton of fucking fun. Um, but then I'll be able to like go through like certain things like that. Like if you want to ask certain questions and like go through a workout or something with me and you know, people like that. Anyway, people like that being like me and me and maybe Kevin and maybe I'll bring Nadine, but probably not because he's a douchebag and he likes me all the time. If you're watching this video, fuck you. Um, but anyways, that's a long story, but it's really not. You can just go back to my YouTube videos. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it just came about one day, but okay, sorry. So this exercise, right? It was like, this motherfucker has ADD. Someone made a comment once and it was so funny. He goes, I think I like my IQ drop listening to Bradley. <laughs> Cause I am scattered. But look, look, I know that's just how I am. And to be truthful with you guys, like I, I've learned to just like not give a fuck. I've learned to just like people are gonna like, is that $5 right there? No, it's not. It's, that tricked me, bro. What is that shit? It's a candy. Whether it's a candy, it's a coffee candy. Anyways, the point is like what I've learned is that people are either gonna love you they're gonna hate you. Either way, fuck it. If you enjoy what you're doing, just be it. Just do it. Just be that. Like own that shit. And uh, I promise you, I won't make you drop your IQ. I'll help you get bigger arms. Like Kevin has bigger arms, so fuck with me. He also is more vascular too. Anyways, um, this exercise, like I said, focus on letting your elbows like kind of dip forward. Like your your back super arch, right? Your arch. Let your elbows dip forward. Yep. Your elbows dip forward, and then when you come up, kind of like rotate your hands up and over your yeah, head and squeeze. Yeah, it's a dance move. It's like a fucking dance move. Did it look like one? Do it again. You ready? Yeah. Hey, hey. For, hey. Sure. for sure. For sure? For sure? Yeah. Okay, that's the new shit. That's the, that's the Brad dance. Like everything that I name and just put my name in front of it and say that yeah. what it is, like that, if that was my car, what would that be called? Come on, bro. A Brad car? Exactly. Damn. Exactly. That was my bike, which is not a Brad bike. Damn, no, your, your bike. My no. bike is not white, bro. Left okay. it at home. I left it. I don't have a bike. Yeah, you do. I do have a bike. I do have a bike. Anyways, that's that's not the last. Yeah, it was. No, no, no. Last exercise. Okay, I finished Finish. off. I know. I thank you, bro. Finishers. You finally trying to help me when I actually knew it this time. I remember finishers. It wasn't. It's. I, I mean, you can call it a finisher because at the at this exercise is gonna hit all those muscle groups. It's gonna hit your biceps. It's gonna hit your chest. It's gonna hit your triceps. It's gonna hit your clavicles. It's gonna hit your elbows. It's gonna hit everything that I was just hitting in that whole workout and it's just a finish. So, so do six sets, as many reps as possible. Focus on contracting your chest and squeezing your triceps at the finish. So like start it with your chest, like you're, you're here, right? Start it like squeezing your chest, right? As hard as you can. And then when you get to the top, squeeze your triceps, okay? And do that shit every fucking rep. I promise you, you're, it's gonna burn, it's gonna hurt, but it's gonna feel good when the girl's like, damn, your triceps are looking good, bro. She's not gonna say bro. She wouldn't say bro. She'd be like, Nah, that's inappropriate. I don't want to go there. Maybe I do, but no, I don't want to go there. I don't want to do it on YouTube. But I love you guys. I'm wait, out. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah. Tell them that thing. Remember the really important. Oh, bro. Oh my God. All right. We so almost forgot. Right, all right, all right. All right. So I almost forgot. I almost forgot. Right. So there is this like really, really. What's up, man? Put him in the video real quick. Say what up. Hey, hey, no hey hell yeah. No, I love the game, bro. Hey, hell yeah. How about this shit, bro? Hey, right on, man. Yeah. Um, so it's a really, really, really important. And I know I kind of hyped it and I didn't talk about it the last one, but this time I might actually talk about it. Um, I mean, is it, is it bad timing? Hold on, let me figure it out. Let me... Yeah, the wind, it's, it's, it's blowing a little bit too east. Yeah, the wind is blowing a little. So I can't tell it right now, but if you want me to tell it, remember a comment, maybe go on my Instagram, maybe tweet me. Um, probably go on the Instagram and just go in the comment section here and be like, just tell me, right? Just say it. What, one of those, hashtag whatever, right? Hashtag just say it, just tell me, whatever. But it's a big, big thing and I wanna to talk to you guys about it. And I've been wanting to talk about it for a long time. I just was always trying to figure out the right way to talk about it. And it's just, it's gonna like, motherfuckers' brains are gonna be like. <sighs> you see what I did, it was like the atmosphere and shit. It was like the atmosphere, like it's like space. Anyways, I'm out guys. So much more coming soon. That video is coming too. 
I just want, you know, I just want to like, I want to, I want to change shit. I want to change the game. I'm going to change the game. Mark my motherfucking words. I'm out.